All right, soccer, baseball, and basketball have all returned in one form or another. Football appears to be right around the corner now. Keenan Singleton has the story on one Miami football player's impressive body of work. Tommy Doyle's heart chose hockey. I always thought I was going to go to the NHL. I always wanted to be like an enforcer. The rest of his body put those dreams on ice. Like many of us, Doyle outgrew his first love while in high school. And then he kept growing and growing and growing. The one-time enforcer is now a protector as Miami's starting left tackle. And he's opening eyes nationally. A member of the Outland Award watch list. First team all Mac. And with an invite to the Offensive Lineman Mastermind Summit earlier this July, an unofficial nod as one of the best tackle prospects in the 2021 NFL Draft, where he was just one of a dozen college linemen selected to attend the NFL-dominated gathering. The coolest part was just being able to hear these, these NFL players, um, some of the advice they gave to some of the younger college guys there. Um, I learned a lot. Even in that gaggle of big men, Doyle stands out at 6'8", 340 pounds. And yet, he's still growing as a football player. He didn't begin playing the game until a sophomore year in Edina, Minnesota, a town ESPN recently crowned as the center of U.S. hockey. That's the first thing you learn how to do, it seems like, is skate. He didn't stick with the sport. His coordination led him off the ice to football, where he played linebacker and defensive line. On the recruiting trail, Red Hawks offensive line coach George Barnett convinced Doyle to take a path he had never taken to the one position where you never want to be on skates, the offensive line. Anytime you have to project or, or you're going to throw a kid in the deep end that he's not used to being in, and you've got to rest on something. A D lineman, it's, you can be a little bit more reckless. I think as I learned in offensive line, it's, uh, it's a lot of fundamentals, it's a lot of technique, it's a mental game. In just three short years, he's gone from his first kick slide to kicking hides. His tape against Iowa's A.J. Epinesa, the Buffalo Bills second round pick this year, shows his growth. It has NFL evaluators hungry for more. He's still in year four of his development, which is scary. Come April, Doyle's heart will be pumping as his hand reaches for the commissioners at the draft. Now Gary Bettman's but Roger Goodell's. I'll get over it. Keenan Singleton, WCPO 9 Sports.